Today we're going to cover the topics of taxonomy and biological classification so as to be able to catalog the diversity of life. The diversity of life is truly extraordinary. Remarkably divergent forms that have evolved over millions of years. But how do we make sense of all this diversity? To understand the diversity of life, we first start with the assumption that all species share a common ancestry. Based on this, we then work out how these lineages may have derived and what the relationships are between modern species. So to do this, we use a process we called classification. And there are several different terms that are involved with this process. The first is taxonomy, which is the science of naming, describing, and classifying different organisms. Secondly, we often refer to this as systematics. Systematics is a scientific study of the diversity of organisms and their evolutionary relationships. Now, of all the multicellular species that we see on Earth today, there is extraordinary richness in some taxa more than others. You can see that out of this large number of different species, we have a few vertebrates up here at the top, some starfishes, various different kinds of worms and rotifers, then a whole bunch of arthropods. Okay? This includes the insects. So there are vast numbers of different kinds of mosquitoes, large numbers of weevils, a lot of different butterflies, and an incredible number of beetles. Beetles, beetles everywhere. What we want to try to do is try to understand ultimately why there are so many different kinds of beetles.